I went around, um, did walks around all the geysers and watched them all, and then would come back and paint, and then I would be there interacting with people and watching Old Faithful go off. I was really engaged with the public. That's the whole idea of the Artist in Residence program. The national parks want the artists to have the ability to spend time in the park and, and spark their own creativity, and at the same time, teach visitors at the park about the arts and how to get involved. Linda Amon did her serious painting at night when the guests weren't around. Then during the day, she taught everyone that they too could create art. One of them was this great big guy that I said, oh, you can come and do a painting. He said, no, no, I can't do that. And I said, I challenge you. I said, I bet you that I can make you into an artist in 20 minutes. And he came and he said, you're on. So he did this painting and he was walking around showing everybody his, his painting. And that was repeated over and over. Sometimes Eamon would make an entire group or family come in together, sit down and paint, and they would be so amazed at what they could accomplish. And there were a lot of visitors from foreign countries, but Amos says there was never a language barrier. I taught um, a gentleman that um, it was a young lady's father that I believe was from China, and she said that she wanted him to take the class, but he had no English. And I said, there are no barriers. And he went away just thrilled and she interpreted how excited he was that he was very comfortable taking the class because, again, we were showing things and explaining things and it didn't have to be in his language. Eamon says her work will be forever changed by this artist in residence experience. Her favorite piece is this buffalo in which she used painting techniques she had never used before. I'm going to continue this series um, and I'm just going to take it farther and farther with the realisms of it and also the emotions that I felt that it came from it.